Hi everyone, happy Sunday. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a little footy here. 21-22 tops finest UEFA Champions League soccer, four box. It says half case, but that's not correct. This is a finest is a 12 box case. I think they, or is that the eight box case and 12 packs inside? We're gonna find out. Losing my mind. So I brain still on vacation. Anyway, a four box break. Those teams are in, a couple combos there, and we're giving away four extra spots. So we only sold 16 spots outright. We're gonna randomize the top, the 16 in the top four. We'll get extra spots. That's our first dice roll. After seven times, two and a five. One, two, three, four, five. Sixth and seventh and final time. Louis, you got three of the four. Kevin, you snuck in there with an extra spot for yourself as well. Next four box break in the store right now if you want to get after it. All right, let's put those little rooftops next to your name so you know you won that in the this little randomizer here. Now, let's do the official randomizer for your names and the teams. Let's roll it and randomize both of those lists, three and a two, five times each. One, two, three, four, five. Three and a two, five times for the teams. One, two, three, four, and five. After five times, we've got Atalanta, down to my club, Liverpool. All right, so Louis, you have Atalanta. Harry with Leipzig, Red Bull Leipzig. Louis, you got Barcelona. Ian with Paris Saint-Germain. Brian with Inter. Louis with Chelsea. Ryan with AC Milan. Louis with Man United. Kevin with Bruges and Lille. Rosario with Atletico Madrid. Aaron with Wolfsburg and Sevilla. Louis, you got Sporting and Bayern Munich. Jason with Dortmund. Louis with Real Madrid. Kevin with Juventus. Sean with Porto Salzburg. And Louis with Man City, Ajax, and Liverpool. So let's sort by uh, column B here by team. And we're going to pause the video for a little bit. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades. And then we'll have the break. So stick around. We'll be right back all right welcome back everybody no deals were done TWC trading window close here on Sunday the 9th thanks everybody for getting in so that list remains the same all right there it is 21-22 tops UEFA Champions League You know what throws me off? This is in a different... Okay. No, that's... It's totally me. It's... In my head, I initially started thinking of this as, as uh, Top Chrome, which automatically put me in... in 12-box mode. That's finest. Eight boxes. So we got four on the left side and four on the right side. We're gonna roll this nice uh, Liverpool red die here. We'll go one, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. And it's one, we'll go left side and this side will be for break 12. Which is already loaded up on jazbeescasebreaks.com right now. So there it is, marked 12. 12 right here, so you know they're from the same case. Would love to run this back tonight. All right. Let's get 
first box going here. Oh, there's my knife. Just knock my finger around all over. It's alright. Good luck. My first break back from a uh, from a little a little vacay to Vegas, so gotta get myself warm back up here. Get into the group breaking groove. Saw some summer league action, ladies and gentlemen. In Vegas. Saw Wenbanyama in action or in action as the case may be. But he's so much taller and his, ar his arms are so easily so much longer than everybody else. It's kind of crazy to see, to witness live. Saw Scoot Henderson drop 33 points in a summer league game. He looked really good. Go to Chaden Sharp. Nice, good. I'm glad you guys did. Yeah, summer cut crit. I remind you, I need, I gotta get a haircut at some point. My hair is never as long as Chris's, but I feel like it's feeling a little heavy. But yeah, summer league. Does, that was my first time going to NBA summer league. It was pretty awesome. It was a cool experience. My, my cousin Dan, who often goes to these things, was saying that even the Zion year that he went to was not as, as busy. The buzz wasn't as big as it was for this Wemby year. If that gives you any indication of, of the, uh, the Wembanyama hype. All right, out of uh, 150, there's a Baranza for Sporting. That'll be for Louis. I'm assuming all cards ship in this. Yeah, all cards ship in this. Cristiano Ronaldo. And it's probably worth looking up all of these rookies too, right, because you know, who knows what their value is now compared to when this set first came out. That'd be something just good to research. Here's a rookie auto, Yusuf Demir for Barca. That will go to that will go to Louis and a Barcelona. Oh, yeah, you should go to summer league games, Chilo. I think it's a. Uh, it's kind of cool, like, you know, like scouting, you know, quote unquote, air quotes, scouting these players that you're going to see in upcoming sets. If you're just a basketball fan, I think that's going to be something enjoyable right there. There's Doniel Malen for Dortmund. Here's Leo Messi. There, um, the, at the Vegas Summer League, there's two courts. So there's the main court where UNLV plays, and then there's like a side court, like a practice court. It's about the size of a high school gymnasium. And it's that that room is cool. That's where they play like the secondary games. I guess the ones that you see on like, so the main court is ESPN, and the secondary court is like NBA TV, the NBA Network. It's Paul Scholes, Centurions. I thought that might be numbered, but it's not. That's also cool because you can probably get even closer to the players, and be able to. Uh... Oh, nice Mbappe refractor. Where does he end up? Does he stay or does he go? That that PSG owner imposed a deadline. It's, it's getting close. There's Fabio Vieira to 250. But yeah, so that room was cool. I, I watched, I think Toronto, I saw the Raptors Bulls game in that smaller gym, which was really cool to see. And there's Eduardo Camavinga. Nice. Great autograph for Real Madrid. That's going to go to Louis. Nice. 
There's Christian Pulisic, who I think is finalizing his move to AC Milan, I think. All right, nice start. Next box. But yeah, uh, I would highly recommend it to you, Gilo, and everybody else. If you want to do a summer league. Most years, apparently, are not as crazy as it was this year. But you can buy, I think it was, it's general admission, so there's no seating, right? It's all just first come, first serve. I think it was 60 bucks for the day. You can say they're all day. I think there's ins and outs too, but I think it's 60 bucks for the day. And I mean, how, how early do games start? They go to 11, and I think the last game, which was the Lakers-Warriors game, which was really cool, started at 8. And parking was free too, which was shocking. I'm so used to like LA where everyone charges parking for like a zillion dollars at every arena here. But yeah, parking was free. I think you can, I think if you buy like extra, you can buy, I think you can pay for like covered parking. We just parked out of the, the general parking lot and just uh, battled the 110 degree heat for a couple hundred yards to get into the stadium. But there was, what else was there? I don't know, it was just falling all around. I mean, you saw, you see basketball players walking around in every hotel and around the arena and stuff like that. Um, a lot of good concessions at the Thomas and Mack Center where UNLV play. Pedri. And there's Matthias De Ligt to 99 for Juve. That's for Kevin. Rex is remembering that there's no more first class postal service. What, they don't have that anymore? It's, it's called Parcel Ground Advantage. Do they need to rebrand re first class? There's Moriva for Leipzig to 150. Red Bull Leipzig is for Harry. And we got a Nico Williams autograph for Liverpool. Nice. That's my club. That's going to go to Louis. Three out of five. Nice. Out of fives and under, get the train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo-woo. Nice one. There's Jude Bellingham who finally made his move. All right, next side here. It's Karim Benzema and there's Shola Shoretire. 150 out of 250 for Man United. That'll also be for Louis. Sven Boatman to two ninety nine for Lille. That will be for the Bruges Lille combo. That will be for Kevin. There's Lille Net Messi for PSG, and João Felix for Atletico Madrid, Atletico Madrid edition of João Felix. That's for Rosario. That's to one fifty. Where is he? Is he still at Chelsea? He was pretty highly, he's still pretty young. He's only 23 years old. He was on, I think he was on loan to Chelsea, right? But it didn't quite work out. And then now he's back with Atletico Madrid. Gilo thinks that, that, uh, that what, NBA is advertising Summer League a bit more. Yeah, I, I guess mostly because... Summer League has always been in Vegas for a long time. And then they do like a, and then they have a, some Summer League games in Sacramento. I think they call that the California Classic. So that's always been on the radar, at least for California sports fans. 
But yeah, I think it's becoming more of a TV event now. I feel like I feel like ESPN and the NBA network have really been broadcasting more games. And I don't know if that was always the case. Or maybe it was more maybe NBA TV broadcast most of the games and it wasn't really on the bigger the bigger network, something like that. But yeah, I feel like I've been hearing some more some more buzz on that too. Probably is Wemby effect, probably is just a conscious dis effort to promote that more. I mean, it's NBA in the middle of the summer where not much is going on except for well, golf majors and baseball. Everything else is over, drafts are all over. It's a nice little mid-season sort of hoops warm-up. All right, third box. Seventy-two out of one twenty-five. Uh, Lucas and Mecha for Wolfsburg. That's going to go to Aaron. Another Cristiano Ronaldo. This Man United edition, by the way. And our autograph is for AC Milan. Pierre Kalulu. It's going to go to Ryan. Yeah, NBA playoff playoffs is kind of long, isn't it? I always want to. I always feel like if I was like NBA king of king for the day, or Sergio Ramos to two ninety nine, that I would. Uh, that I would shorten the season and just keep the playoff lengths the same. What does everyone think about the? Uh, I know with this, we're in the middle of a soccer break, but. What about the, that new, uh, yeah, nice Christian Ronaldo, 96 out of 99 for Louis and Man United. What about the basketball uh, tournament, the in-season tournament. I don't think, and here's our autograph for Barca, that's Yusuf Demir. The wave looking autograph here, 48 out of 99 for uh, Louis and Barca. And then there's Latan to 250 for AC Milan. That's for Ryan. All right, final box. Good luck, everybody. Second half of this is in the store. Get after it. Thank you. But the in-season tournament is interesting. I don't think they're adding extra games for like it's. The reason I guess why it makes sense is it's sort of like a cup competition. So they're kind of emulating that European cup competition style of things that they do in soccer. But I don't think it's additional games. I think they've just designated some games as, I don't know, uh, what do you, how do you want to call it? Like, like they call it in, like, we're in, in like PGA golf, like there's elevated tournaments or something like that, designated events. So this is sort of that kind of thing where, where hey, it's, this is all part, still part of the regular season 82, but this is also, there's a little more stakes because of um, because it's a cup competition. So I think there's a trophy and money involved for now. They're playing around with the idea. I think Adam, I saw this report. I think they're, they're, they were playing around with the idea of, hey, um, this could mean, a, the winner of this cup competition could mean a playoff spot. That's on the table. I think basically they're thinking, uh, you know, and I think both all the front office or front office. I think the association, the league office, seems to be saying that you're just going to kind of start this small. They don't expect it to be a hit right out of the gate. They don't expect people to like it right out of the gate. But they're kind of kind of getting the ball rolling on that, which I think is kind of cool. 
I don't know what the tournament's officially called. Ooh, nice Lionel Messi refractor for PSG. That's for Ian with Paris Saint-Germain. I don't know what it's called. Does anyone off the top of their head? We'll look it up after the break. There's Ansu Fati, the 299 for Barca. I'm sure it'll. Uh, I'm sure it's pending a, 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 a title sponsor. There's Kyle Jorge to 25 for Juve. That's going to be for Kevin. Who do you think the title sponsor is going to be? The the DraftKings NBA Cup. Who's the official car sponsor of the NBA? The Kia? There's Edwin Vandersar to 75. I think, what was the latest Edwin Vandersar news that I saw recently? Sad news. Yeah, he's in the hospital. He's in intensive care following brain bleeding. I don't know how that happened. Some intensive care. Not sure if it was as a result of an accident or if it was just something that happened. But yeah, he's, he's, he's remaining in intensive care. He's only 52. So, that's for Ajax. That'll be for Louis. Get well soon to Edwin van der Sar. Great keeper in his day. And there's Danny Olmo for Red Bull Leipzig. That'll be for Harry. To 50. Uh, there is Benjamin Sesco to 150 for Salzburg. That'll be for Sean, who has the Porto Salzburg combo. Got a uh, 90 out of 199, Kyle. That is for for Juve, once again, for Kevin. I was hoping, I'm sure Jason was hoping the same thing. I was hoping we'd see more Erlen Holland base cards or maybe even numbered cards, but here's one. Dortmund edition in this set this for this year. Jason with that one. There's an Mbappe, and there's a Pierre Kalulu for Ryan and AC Milan. And there you have it, boys and girls. Nice little break here. 21-22 tops finest UEFA Champions League soccer. Half case random team number 11 from jazbeescasebreaks.com. Second half in the store right now. Let's get after it. Remember, uh, and we're still giving away those four extra spots too. So buy a full spot. You got a chance to win a full spot. It'll help you get some of the nicer teams. And maybe we'll get some nice cards for you. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time for the next one.